okay. know, there are no vehicles that can take us to Mars right now. Right. And we don't go for rides as astronauts. We, we, I mean, I helped design the cockpit of the shuttle. So, that, so you were so, trained as an engineer? Yeah, I, I have okay. an engineering background. Uh -huh. And I mean, I helped change how we operate the Soyuz. Even as, as the pilot of a Russian Soyuz, I helped change some operations in the Soyuz. We, we are intrinsically involved with making space flight safe. And so go to Mars, sure, conceptually, it's easy to say, yeah, sure, I'd love to. I got the orbit, I can plot it out, I, I'm <laughs> yeah, there. Just go 40% faster on our way, but, but I, want, I would want to be really involved with the vehicles and, and making sure that we had a reasonable shot. I don't want to die on the way to Mars, but I would love the opportunity to be part of that exploration. Well, Mars, that's of course, would be a very long journey. With the engines we have now, yeah. Yeah, certainly, and if it's a sort of a, a free energy transfer, there was a nine months or something there. Yeah, I, then you gotta wait till we line up again, Earth and, Earth and Mars. We're so, never gonna go that way. So this, this, these are years, yeah. and so they would, we, you would need many guitars and many songs. <laughs> and many, many cans of tuna, I think. <laughs> yeah, I really, we, we, my prediction, we will never go to Mars with the engine technology we have right now. It's like trying to set up uh, airline flights to Australia in 1920. Impossible. You know? I don't think we, we just we don't have the technology to make it safe enough that we can ever do it. Uh, we need we need to go from propellers to jets. We need to go from string wings to to metal wings. We get we got to invent a bunch of stuff first. And there's no rush to go to Mars. There's no there's no urgency. The Earth is. A concern, but it's not horribly threatened that we have to abandon it. I think it's going to be incremental from station. That'll be a that's a thirty-year project from station to the moon. That's probably a fifty-year project, and then eventually station, International Space Station. Yeah, and then eventually to Mars. But there, there's no big rush. This is just natural. Why not create a rush? Why not? <laughs> well, the, the the trouble is if you if you make it a race. Then, as soon as the first person crosses the finish line, then you're done. You're done. It's not. It, it's not. It's in the culture not how we explore. It's not the right thing to do. I'm with you on that. Yeah.